Yeah, I mean, shit's going haywire. The stream is crashing and burning as we speak. Where's my squad? Are they here? Did they make it? Hey, hey, talk to me. Say something. Oh God! Oh God! Hey, hey, what are they doing? What's going on there? Hey, hey where are you taking me? No! Hey! No! Let's do it. Ah! Uh, before my eyes start to bleed. Where am I? Hey, what is this place? Hey, where are you taking me? I don't want to spend a fucking 54 minute time to the leaderboards, it's embarrassing. Hey, wait. If I have a 52, maybe I'll submit it. Don't leave me here! Just to get the ball rolling. Josh, Josh, is that you? Alex. <laughs> Josh, where are you going? Josh, stop! go. So far, so good. All right, one bug, I'm calling it. I've actually had really good luck lately. I think with like the bugs in this part.
Sometimes the body block there is strong. At that time it was not strong. So far so good. I'm like freaking out over this. Yeah, like it's a handy mechanic. I guess it kind of makes sense, but I mean, it's nice because we get to abuse it. I want my toy, you little kid. Guess you're not my friend. Okay, I'll go see if I can find you. I hate that first split because it's always like roughly the same and it's like, it just looks dumb if it's like, oh no, I lost time. But it's like, like an irrelevant amount of time every time. It's hard for anything to like change in the hospital, you know, there's no like variance. Yeah, I guess bait. <laughs> I mean, it didn't work. Damn, foiled by those button presses. I would have got them if it weren't for those. You didn't mash X so quickly. Strange to be back here again. Hello? Hello? Huh, that's strange. I'm gonna go look around. You just stay here. I got gypped. <laughs> Whatever. God damn it. Didn't spawn. 
Jerk. Well, I mean, Silent Hill isn't supposed to be a place of punishment, though. Like, it's not meant to be anything. It's a town with a lot of, like, supernatural shit. In the instance of this game, where if you... It's like the town being punished for breaking the pack, that I mean... I feel like getting murdered by monsters is pretty punish punishing. It's, there's nothing personal about it. It's just... You get fucking killed. That's like what happened to a lot of people. Yeah, that whole notion is like entirely Silent Hill 2. Like, Heather's not getting punished in Silent Hill 3, she's just fucking stuck in stupid Silent Hill Otherworld bullshit because Claudia's a bitch. Like, the, there's no vendetta in this game, you know? There's nothing like. The town's not pissed off at Alex or something like that. It's like. Monsters started showing up because they fucking ruined the packs. Yeah, exactly. Heather didn't do shit. Claudia's, like, I don't know, summoned otherworldly stuff somehow. I don't know the details, but it's like, it's just really, like, general. Yeah, that's also true. We're not even in Silent Hill yet. Give me a shitty split. It was like 36 last time. Whatever, I just want to finish a run, you know? I mean, I definitely don't know enough, enough about the plot, like, I can't even remember the details anymore. But I do know enough that it's like, this isn't like Alex-centric, like, everything that's happening. What's that guy doing? Dude, that little bite is fine. But it's like, not even like, I just mean like, the town's retribution or whatever is an Alex-centric. Like, all the big monsters just go and fucking kill their parents. And like, Alex is just mucking around like a nerd. Anything to you.
Oh yeah, I know. The, the situation's entirely Alex's fault, but like, I'm just saying, it's not like... I don't know. Like, everyone else has to deal with the bullshit that happens much more than he does, because he left. Cause, like, <laughs> which is fucking based. He's like, damn, I killed my brother, and then I'm like, well, I'll go to the army. Well, I guess he didn't actually go to the army, but like, he has to be- he, has, he must have been somewhere at the beginning of the game that wasn't here. I guess it was supposed to be like an institution or whatever. I forget where, like, geographically that was. Yeah, robots, I feel like that's the biggest question mark. Like, what if they just moved, you know? But did he just, like, hitchhike home from the mental ward? I'm surprised they would even let him do that. Like, okay, your therapy's done, enjoy, you know, walking home or whatever. Hitchhiking with strangers, whatever, we don't care. Hello? Can I ask you something? Yeah, he shouldn't have come back. They call it homecoming, like, ironically, like, he should have never come home. Hey, you're Curtis, right? <laughs> See, like, the thing is, Alex's parents are just a bunch of fucking assholes. <laughs> That's the theme of this game, is that his parents fucking blow, his little brother's a little piece of shit, Judge Holloway, like, you know, could have been cool if she didn't try to kill you. L is like, I don't know. She's like a rock with a wig. Like, I'm sure she has, like, you know, a personality or something, but whatever. We won't dwell on that. She's like the Henry Townsend of this game. She's like a potato. In tight jeans. Yeah, see, they should have just killed Alex anyways, whatever. Those guys, they're fucking dumb. Everyone in this town's stupid, and they all deserve what came to them. Especially the part where Alex and Elle get abducted by UFOs, and Wheeler survives because Wheeler's based. Like, that has to be the canon ending. Like, what else is there? The one where the dad magically survives and then drowns you? Or like, the one where you turn into a pyramid head? Like, come on. Oh, okay. I didn't know I was in there. See, that's why I mean, Wheeler totally doesn't deserve it, because he's too fucking cool. He doesn't know any of what the fuck's going on. He's just running around being super cool. Yeah, the mom gets stretched to death. Just by a random machine. It's not even a big demon machine, it's just like she's strapped into some stretchy thingamajigger. Whatever. Oh, is that like when it's supposed to take place? Is before they send you to mental asylum? Cause like, 
I never really put that together. I always figured they were just fucking making an epic ending. Let's leave this place, Alex. I can't even remember what the other endings are. I haven't gotten any of their ones in so long. There's like the regular, the quote, like, canon good ending, which is booty. Garbage thumbs down. What's the other one? There's at least one other ending, isn't there? Okay, good UFO, drowning, uh, pyramid head. What the fuck? I can't even remember. Don't barf. Barf off screen, that's cool. Yeah, I'd be down to do like a photos one, that'd be fun. There's only like a few of them. It'd be fun because it would force you to do the game almost entirely glitchless. There'd probably be like small skips to like, for like, you know, the other world house or whatever. But I'm pretty sure a lot of the photos are in places that we normally skip in virtually every other category. Except glitchless. The electric one, I don't remember that one. You get electrocuted. Yeah, actual glitches is dumb. Like, I never got the appeal. Ah! I'll make up a new it. I'll make up a new category and get a world record in it, and I'll call Guinness, and I'll be in their book. I can't believe the Guinness Book of World Records had, like, a recording for, like, in, like, their speedrun section for the guy who, like, did a speedrun of, like, one of the Disney Infinity sets or some shit. Wait, so there's only five endings? I mean, that's that's totally possible and all, I was just wondering. Because I know there's like six... like, permutations of the choices you can make. Oh my god. All right, good night, robots. What? There should be six. There's like three options that can do things. Wheeler, mom, and dad. What? No, it's three factorial. Oh my god.
Oh yeah, I guess since there are two choices, it's okay. Yeah, I know what you mean. I'm trying to like speedrun at the same time as doing this shit. Um I've been having trouble with like the those stupid selections. So like, I don't know, it's just, just, it's just weird that there's like that many variations of the endings, but like only, there's only like what, what were they, five endings? I don't know, it's like, it's not as bad as the fucking downpour ending system, which is super cheesy. It's like... The choices you make, whether to like, help or save people, but also like... I guess how many monsters you kill and shit like that. I haven't gotten it that quick in a while. I mean, not like it took a little bit to set up, but like I haven't gotten the actual like wall melt that quickly. My asphyxia split is like always gonna be super hard to beat, at least for these splits. But like, there's so much time to save later, it doesn't even matter. I mean, what's also shitty is that, like, the downpour endings don't necessarily correlate with your actions. Like, it's not like if you're a good person you get a good ending, necessarily. You just get, like, a different, arbitrarily confusing ending. Yeah, I think I remember looking up the page you're looking at Fenrac, because, like, it'll be like, oh, you just, you know, save... Alex, are you there? 
save mom, kill dad, save Wheeler, or whatever, and you'll get this ending. But like, yeah, there should be... There's like three miss- there should be three missing permutations. No, you always get the same options. Save or kill Wheeler, save or kill mom, forgive or don't forgive dad. Wheeler, Wheeler, are they all you show there? up no matter what. Wheeler, come in. So there's got to be like some crossover or something. Don't go up. Don't go up. Fuck. Fuck me. Too greedy, man. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Like, I guess that explains it. Alex, where are you? Seemed really weird. I mean, it's like... Same thing as I mentioned with Downpour, where it's like... The ending you get isn't necessarily, like, derivative of your actions. Also, hey, Parallax, I've been... I completed one run and I've just been, like, resetting a shit ton because I'm not, like, happy with... stuff. So we'll see. Always kill the parents. I always loved how like the UFO ending of this game, like the choices that lead up to it, are like absolutely believable choices someone could make on their first playthrough. If you kill the fucking shitty, awful characters and you save the character that doesn't suck, then you get the abducted by a UFO. <laughs> Brilliant. It looks like I can control the gates for the entire prison from this panel. Yes, it works. Oh my god. Okay, we need to split up. Now here's what you do. Head across the catwalk All right, to the quick clip. bars on the far side. Now get out of here. Float like a butterfly.
Okay, well that was like stuttery and weird, but uh, way better than nothing. Okay, I'll take it. I made it in. I'm gonna look around. Hell are we? I don't know, Wheeler, but we have to keep moving. Yeah, I mean, maybe. I just don't think it's like unreasonable in either direction, you know. fix you before. Judge Hall Damn it. Two hit is not bad. Yeah, that is a uh that's top ten otters of all time. Josh, wait. number one will shock you.
Didn't get it. For my father, for I have sinned. It has been four years since my last confession. <sighs> Parallax, I don't know if you're still here, but I don't really understand the conditions of what lets you skip this cutscene or not. I'm lost. I'm so deep. Like I've had it like it seems like to randomly happen sometimes. Why do you think God cares about your problems? Doesn't God give us a chance to repent? Won't he listen to me just this time? There are some people God doesn't bother with. What are you telling me? Are you saying my prayers fall on deaf ears? The only prayer I, I am struggling to focus through a haze of tiredness and I mean well, if that is his will, I accept it. Slightly and drinking, but I it's like I feel like it's exacerbated by the tiredness. Need anything from you. If I'm like super awake, I can like drink forever and nothing happens. If I'm tired and I'm drinking, then I just turn into a fucking mess. A hot mess, but a mess nonetheless. I believe my church slip is really bad. That's cool. was absolutely atrocious. The final boss fight was atrocious. I had so much time to save. Is he not play like poop? Fucking A, that'll that'll do it. There it is. That's why I've been resetting a lot. Yeah, I don't understand. Like, it, it can't be mashing. I don't think it's mashing. I don't know, it's nonsense. Completely ridiculous. Also, hey, Bass Monkey, what's up?
I've been having bad luck with these guys too. They're not having it. Okay, fine. Yeah, sec I mean, second try is okay. Oh my god, I'm losing a lot of health. Don't worry, for the final cutscene, I'm gonna mash as hard as I can. Let's go. On over. See, that's what I just should have done last time. Get out of my way. I'm not even gonna grab the fucking pistol ammo. Is that? Don't think I'm gonna use it. If it gets to the point where I run out of shotgun and rifle ammo against the final boss, I'm just, I just knife. It was weird. It didn't fire the first time I hit the trigger. I've just been mashing random buttons. Also, welcome back, B. Arthur. It's actually really fucking nice. It's weird to get used to because I'm so used to like reading chat and shit during other loading times, but I mean, actually being able to, you know, play the game. Pretty cool. Plus, being way less crashy is fantastic.
That's how phase one's supposed to go. I deserved that. That's how that fight should go. That was way, way better. Your sacrifice will save us all. Joshua will be safe to carry on the family name. Is it me this time? Am I too far? Did I cross that line? Getting hard to tell. Different day and another war. Order shifts, tumbles down. Yeah. <laughs> 